Hey there folks, it's Bobo the Vulture. And I'm time to find Melgoza again. <coughs> so yeah, we're on a big old treasure hunt, folks. Um, I have been uh, searching around Europe. Going into dive bar after dive bar. Looking for information about Manuel Melgoza. Because he's the man that has the map for the uh, treasure that we're looking for. Honestly, I've forgotten the name of the friggin' treasure at this point. My gosh. Um, it's been a few days since I recorded the last video. But, uh... <coughs> oh, I mean, as I suppose you folks know, you watched it. Um, anyway. Uh, what was I gonna say? I was gonna say ahoy there to this matey, and probably supply. Ah, uh, yes. Um, one advantage to doing this Let's Play um, the way that I am and making sure... I mean, it does mean that, like, the scheduling of it can be a little bit uh, difficult at times, just for me personally. But, um... Doing this one with, uh... Doing this one as I go and not posting a whole bunch of stuff in advance has some real advantages for me in that, uh... I can wait for comments that will give me uh, helpful advice if I am ever stuck. Um, <laughs> primarily from Bitbucket Cynic. Hello! Um, but, uh, yes. He noted that um, you'll only hear about uh, sailors in the region where they actually are. Um, and so, you know, I've been to enough places in Europe, I've found out about a lot of sailors here. Maybe time to start looking at other regions. <coughs> uh oh, the sky's dark. Let's weigh anchor. Let's land. Let's land and wait. It is indeed a storm. Although, if I weigh anchor before Hans officially declares it a storm, does my ship take storm damage? We'll find out, folks. Somehow we weathered the storm, so let's go ahead and cast off now that we've done that. I'm going to go ahead and stop at a port here in West Africa. Just because as long as I have um, blood in my veins. No, but uh, as long as I'm passing through, I might as well check with... Uh, yeah, no, our ships are fine. I might as well check in all of the bars and find out whether or not there is, uh... If there's anybody handing out information here. Probably won't be, but, uh... I'm gonna meet some guys. Antonio Pintato. What's going on, Antonio? He's a vagabond sailor. Let's go ahead and treat him. And treat him again. I'm just treating people for the hell of it, you know? Boy, this guy's pretty high class. He needs a lot of treats before I'll tell you what his knack is. There aren't any, uh, capable sailors in Abidjan. In Bathurst. I was about to say, I don't think Bathurst is in this region, but then I remembered they're not thinking of the same Bathurst I'm thinking of. I'm thinking of Bathurst in Australia. At least as far as that guy is aware of, it sounds like he's pretty much the only, uh, the only sailor available for hire in, uh, this region. Which I guess wouldn't be a shock. Ah, yes. Our maps have earned him election to the Royal Academy of Scholars. Oh, he got rich and famous off of us. I hate him so much. Eh, you know. If you're gonna kill him, please try and not tell me as much about it now. Alright. Let's supply up. Yeah, let's go ahead and shove up.
I keep thinking, I, you know, I was about to say aloud, hey, you know, I wonder whether or not we could not necessarily, you know, trying to, like, go out and explore a whole bunch of extra part of the map, but just for, for purposes of, uh, of saving a little bit of time, if we could just, you know, maybe not hug the coast of Africa. I mean, I guess go ahead and fill up with water, but... I actually meant wait until the storm is over. Storm's not over yet, huh? I only have the visual cues of, uh... <clears throat> Fine, I'll hug the coast. That seems to be what you want me to do. Waves are tossing the ships. Ah, uh, well. I'm also concerned that, uh... Ah, somehow we weathered the storm, so let's go ahead and sail. I'm also somewhat concerned that, um... <coughs> as we sail along... Or, sorry, once we eventually find Manuel Meldoza, that uh, his map may be uh, the map that he has to sell, because in theory he's going to offer to give us a map, might not be one that's as uh, immediately recognizable, and uh, I might have to uh, spend some time either thinking about it, or looking at it, or looking at the rest of the world, something like that. before I can, uh, you know, get uh, crack a on uh, finding treasure. Actually, I wonder if I... It's probably actually going to be too far back even to see now in my log. But what if I try? What if I go into my journal? Antwerp. Ah, there it is. The Pot of Fire. That is what I was supposed to be doing. I was given an Imperial Order to find the Pot of Fire. Of course, the Pot of Fire. I found burning water. Is that good enough? Um... Yeah, we're okay for right now. I believe there was a supply port in Madagascar, wasn't there? Oh, on the far end. Well, that's fine. Let's, uh... Let's coil over here to the far end of Madagascar, why don't we? If you guessed that I was thinking about cutting across part of the Indian Ocean here, then you would be correct. Hello there, humble village. We're going to stop in Tamate. Commodore's navigation level went up. No, Antoine's navigation level and knowledge went up. Everybody's getting smarter all the time. I'm kind of curious about my, uh, my mates' stats now. They're all very happy, as you recall having heard before. Yeah. I'm maxed out in, uh, navigation and, uh, knowledge, and, uh, my leadership is pretty darn good. But, you know, my fighting ability, not that great. But anyhow. Yes, that's right, I have 250 trade fame, 
25,000 uh, adventure fame and no fame in piracy. And interestingly, I do not have a strong friendship with Holland, even though I am a Viscount there. How's Niccolo looking? You can see his stats there. He is somewhat better than us in fighting, but otherwise he is yeah, not quite our equal. Niccolo Montaigne, he has a much better fighting ability and is, you know, pretty close in most other respects. He's a much he's a much more balanced character than uh, ours is, because he has at least some physical stats. And Antoine. Antoine, also a pretty balanced character, um, although he's not that much better at fighting than we are. Wait a second. Take a look at Antoine's hair there. Antoine is 27 years old. Now, I apologize if somebody else had already pointed that out, but uh, he's had a rough 27 years. Oh, there, matey, will you be shoving off? Yeah, let's go ahead. We can sail for 30 days, and that's what we're gonna do. Pop told me to sail for 30 days, and that's what I'm gonna do. Figure if I continue sailing in this direction, I'll eventually hit something India-like. One can always hope. I suppose on the way back to Holland, I can just go ahead and circumnavigate the globe again. Hey, what do you know? Here we are. That didn't take very long at all. Oh no, storm's coming. We better get into port. Yes, the waves are tossing the ship. Let's stop in Ceylon. Frackin' Ceylons. Well, we might have to, uh... Might have to come in here to the bar. How's it going there, person? Amboise, Amboise Agne is here. Oh, they're Mateo's left on the high seas. I'm a vagabond sailor. Are you buying me the cafe specialty? Seems like we'll get along well. I got a knack for leadership, you know. There aren't any capable sailors in Malacca or Muscasa or Alboa. Navigator called Shawl was looking for a job in Goa. Nobody in Ternate. Okay. I'm gonna scat. Banda. Oh. Do I like the mango juice? I would like the mango juice better if you were telling me about somebody named Mendoza. Tell me about somebody named Meldoza. Hmm? Hmm? Meldoza? I can't even get him to tell me about the one sailor I think he did mention before. Shoal was looking for a job at Goa. Problem is, I can't remember where Goa is. I mean, I'm sure it's in this region, but you know what I mean. That covers a lot of ground. Hi there. Malik Yassa. Let's gossip with you. Yes, yes, yes. Right, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and sleep. Let's check in for the night. Yeah, that's fine. Let's not let the bed bugs bite.
Let's not let the bed bugs bite cause they hurt. They hurt, man. Hey, you're a traitor, aren't you? Cinnamon, especially in this port. That's us. I just want to make sure Melgoza hasn't arrived in the bar while I was... while I was out. Nope, it's still Amboise Agne. That's fine. Let's go ahead and get our uh, ship repaired. Hey, man, you got a lot of lumber here. What kind of new ships can you make, out of curiosity? Oh, you can afford a new ship. You can make a light galley. Now, let's just get the Dune and the John B. repaired, thank you. Alright. Yeah. Uh, in case you can't tell, I do kind of like the... Uh, music in this place. Right, this was the trader, not the port. Oh, crap, we're gonna get this rigmarole again. Royal Academy of Scholars, I thought we were ruled by a governor general, not a king. I enjoy making accurate maps. To each their own, I guess. I'm sure there are lots of people who would not say that making Let's Plays was a, uh, could use your time. Let's go ahead and sail. Let's sail for 30 days. And once I'm out here, I am going to... Yeah, here we go. gonna go to Goa. Darn it. Let's land. Let's land. And wait. Gonna see whether or not... Because you guys haven't even seen this yet. Of course, you wouldn't necessarily know the difference between me sailing and the computer sailing. But I could put in, you know, if it's a port that I've discovered or I've seen or whatever... I think I've. I think it's just if I've seen it. I don't think I have to have actually um, landed there. But um, India. Let's go to. Let's go to Goa. You see now. Uh, if you have a mate that has uh, celestial navigation or good instruments. You can do that. You can just let them uh, float you along. As you can see there, he sort of like faffed about a little bit more than I might have, just in a beeline. But if you can't remember for sure where the city is, it can be uh, it can be kind of helpful. Anyways, I heard there was a sailor in here, so let's come talk to him. Okay, there's not a sailor in here. There was a sailor. Maybe that sailor is in the hotel. The hotel motel. Yeah, Georg Shaw. What do you want with me? I'm a vagabond sailor. No capable sailors in Dilly, huh? Or Passe. Alright. And yeah, I know about Anye. I just talked to him. I'm beginning to wonder whether, uh... Beginning to wonder whether our man is here. Whether Melgosa is here. I may need to check another region, folks. That would be annoying. Yeah, this guy's not giving me any information. He's just telling me about the other sailor in this region. Whom we've already met. Honestly, I wasn't that impressed. Not that he had any, like, means of impressing me, other than giving me the location of Manuel Melgosa, which clearly he didn't have. Either that or he was just playing coy. 
Since it's 2 a.m., let's come in here and see what the special item is. Short sword. No. Ah, uh, that's alright. It is an ermine coat. We don't need an ermine coat. Bitches think I'm going to be giving that to them. They be tripping. I suppose if we just went into the inn and left quickly. Yeah, everything would be open again and we could get our ship repaired in case it sustained some damage. Uh, let's go ahead and get repairs done. Yep. One point of damage on each of these, I guess. It must... Oh, no. There was a little bit more damage than that to the Jambi. I hoisted up the Jambi's sails and saw how the main sail was set. Anyhow, I'm sure that there's a specialty here and that I should be really excited about it. And yet, I'm just getting supplies. I hope that guy didn't say something really important to me just now. I think he was just saying, oh, holy maybe will you be shoving off? Alright. We're close enough. Let's just backtrack here to the Middle East. See whether or not uh, anybody is buzzing about Melgoza in the Middle East. Where in the world is Manuel Melgoza? Hey, it's a Spanish battle fleet led by Javier Navarro. Navarro's fleet is headed towards the south at a speed of 10 knots, so it's just continually ramming Muscat here. It is allied with Turkey. Muscat love. Wait, did we already hear about the Middle East? I feel like I heard that there weren't any capable sailors here already. Maybe my mind's just playing tricks on me at this point. Ricardo Zapata. How's it going, man? I gotta buy you the specialty just for fun. Knowledge. No capable sailors in Dew. Or Shiraz. We're hearing about a lot of the same uh, areas here. No capable sailors in Qatar. How good you know about Anya. Fantastic. Okay, so Shaw was looking for a job in Goa. Okay. So, is the only place left to look for people gonna be... Well, here, I'll go to the, look, I'll go to the uh, inn, just in case. <sighs> go to the inn, just in case. Somebody's waiting in here. Wait, no, 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 no. I'm not... Well, I mean, I'm tired, but I'm not tired to sleep. I'm tired of... Yeah, okay, they're good navigators in the cafe. That's true. Thanks for the information, buddy. I don't mean to be uh, so dismissive. But, uh, it's been a long... It's been a long few months looking for some dude not really knowing where he is. So he does not seem to be in India at the moment, anyways, or in the India region. He doesn't seem to be in the Middle East region, either. But it's possible he is. Commodore, crew got paid. Am I... Uh, yeah, okay, so... Just sort of uh, skirting the coast of Saudi Arabia here. And stop at one more port in the quote-unquote Middle East. And uh, after I've done that... Let's stop in Yemen. 
after I've done that, I can hop down, take a quick look at Africa. Place where I felt the waves. I know, I know. I say that a lot. I don't say that that much, do I? Ah, I felt the waves. Ah, okay. I was a good navigator at the cafe. I'm gonna go talk to him. There's not gonna be a good navigator at the cafe. Come on, we all know. No, oh, that's not the cafe. This is the cafe. Is it just my crew? Damn it, it's just my crew. Ugh. doesn't have to be somebody that is looking for a job. It could just be somebody that says, My name is Pierre. I sail with the battle fleet from England. I come to have sex with your family. What? No. Come on. Shoot up little. Shoot up little. I need to supply. I need to sail. I suppose I may have to label this video skippable if it turns out that I can't actually find a lick of, uh... Let's go ahead and stop Masawa. Is Masawa considered Middle East? Masawa is still considered Middle East, so... Hey, look, this place is buzz with activity. Hey, old man. Yeah, you got pimento here, huh? Good to know. Their talented navigator at the cafe. Thank you, Hitler. Never say Hitler didn't do anything for us. Oh, but the bar is closed. Curse you, Hitler! What's this place? Oh, this building is locked. Oh, I see. This place is a mystery, is what it is. Apparently a mystery from a cheesy horror movie, I didn't realize. Fine, none of you people want my money. Not that I was going to spend any. But none of you want it anyways. None of you want my theoretical dollars. Close! Alright, let's see. Nope, it's going to be closed until 8 o'clock. Fine. I will exit and leave this place once more. Sorry, twice more. That's what I meant to say. The amount of time that you spend in there is kind of strange. Sometimes it will be... And it's just my f***ing eyes. I'll shove off. No. No, why don't you shove off? Huh? Why don't you just shove off? Leave me alone. I wonder if the sky is as black as a raven's wing. Let's stop in Mecca. Come on, tell me there are going to be sailors here. Religious sailors. Sailing the vast seas of spirituality. Hey, they got a girl here. Hey, Sabino Balboa. Oh, there, matey. I life on the seas. I'm Balboa. I'm a ragabond sailor. You buy me the cafe specialty? Oh, it seems like we get along well. I hate to brag, but I have a knack for acting. You're an old capable sailor than must get. There ain't any in that boy either. Well, you know that guy everybody already told you about? I know him, too. And nobody in Kochi. And nobody in my guy either. Oh, yo, you talk to the girl at the bar. I think her name is Adrian. All right, this is pointless. And it. Oh, 
only one thing for it. Yeah, I've heard all the news about Mercator. All the news ever about Mercator. We're in the Middle East. We're in Mecca. It's allied with Turkey. Let's just supply and sail. Yep, I bet that's going to cost me a lot of money. Let's shove off. Governor General, how come you couldn't have just asked me about some of my discoveries? I would have told you about them. I wouldn't even have gone giving them to that guy who's charging money. Or not charging money, but offering me money for my secrets. Then I could have become, you know, uh, Vice Regent Von Bohr or something like that. Wouldn't you have enjoyed that? You know, having a little buddy? Hey there, little buddy. Alright, this should be a whole new region. Mogadishu, yes. Mogadishu. Give me the scoop. Give me the scoop, sailors. You guys are my sailors. I'm beginning to lose patience with you, game. Uh, sometimes I just have to take in the lapping of the waves. Alright. Let's go to the end. I think we all know the answer to the question of whether or not there's going to be anybody at the end. That answer is only if you count that one portrait whose face changes over and over as it says, I heard of good navigator at the cafe. And now we get this dialogue again about the uh, Royal Academy of Scholars. Well, it seems like Hans has backed off on his whole hey, you guys should totally get married for no apparent reason. Talk. Talk Talk. By Talk Talk from the album Talk Talk. Let's sail. I hate to have this video be completely pointless, but it looks like it's going to be. To be. Well, not to be. Not to be. Let's stop in Melindy and look for sailors. Hey, sailors! Do you guys even have a bar? Okay, you have a bar. This is actually kind of happening in town. Look, I know you want a drink, buddy, but uh, I gotta talk to some sailors. Got priorities here. They're my friggin' sailors. He's going to be tucked away in Timbuktu or something like that. Uh, no. Oh, f screw you, pudgy red mage. I'm so over this search for Mel Melgoza. Uh, unbelievable. By the way, don't you think it's about time you took the oath? Well, forget that whole thing I was saying about Hans backing off on that old beat. And the beat goes on. Take the oath? What are you talking about? You know, first do no harm. The Hippocratic Oath. What? Come on, cut it out now. I totally do harm. Yeah, I give me the friggin' pike and I will totally wreck some toys. If you say so. Phew. I almost had to uh, express affection for someone. Alright. Oh, dang it! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get our supplies. I'll have a day or two to think about it. Well, either a day or two to think about it, or a day or two to get... Uh, more input about uh, the likeliest whereabouts of Manuel Malagoza. Pretty much the one thing we accomplished this whole uh, 
This whole video is that small strip of uh, water explored in between Madagascar and, uh, uh, you know, India there. Sri Lanka, I guess. Yeah. Um, so, if, um... If you know the whereabouts of Manuel Malgoza, call Crime Stoppers. I don't call Crime Stoppers. He just knows about a map that we want, or has information. We know that he's got a map, but we are not supposed to know that yet. I guess. Anyhow, folks, this is Bobo the Vulture. This is Let's Play Uncharted Waters, New Horizons, and I thank you very much for watching. Bye bye now.